Hey everyone, check out this track. So on this rap part in the middle of the chorus, I had a bit of a problem lately, this one. Lakers in the tuple box. Which is that some of the phrases were not aligned in pitch and that kind of stressed me out when I was trying to make the mix and the master more dense of this track. Because in the moment where you really try to heat up the music, those dissonances can sometimes pop up out of the background where they were before. So what I did then was I melodined both of these tracks individually, even though it's more like a rap-ish sound, I did melodine pitch and it really helped. And then I was wondering how can I make sure that it's, um, that it's it's all over the project because you know I have multiple choruses here and Bitwig does not have error support so you cannot just copy it over and then it will have the same settings over here unfortunately but then I came up with a cool technique that I want to share with you in this video and it works like this it only works when you have exactly two tracks by the way on the one track you pan hard left on the other track you pan hard right by the way on both of the tracks I have an instance of BX crispy tuner after Melodyne to sweeten up the way it drifts to the other notes because I like the way that autotune ish plugins drift from one note to another as a stylistic effect you know otherwise I could have done everything with just Melodyne and then you go to the group of the vocals and you deactivate all of the effects that you had on there temporarily and then you hit bounce which I did and when you have done that you can copy the effects from here onto your bounce track these are the same effects basically the additional thing that I did here was that I used a stereo split where I put BX crispy tuner into both lanes so that the hard pen left and the hard pen right vocal each have their own tuning and that's the same as if you had two individual tracks now you might wonder okay but you don't want to have the hard pen sound in that case you can just follow it up immediately with a tool where you just decrease the width and they will come together in the center more and that's how you have full control on the two individual vocals even though you are just using a single track you could even imagine putting even more into the stereo split in order to you know set the vocals apart even more from each other for example you could do something like this now without even listening I know that it's often a good technique to just invert the gains of two different tracks maybe that's a little bit much but let's just listen to how this would sound Blake's in the tuple box Check out this super vox. Yeah, so this sounds pretty reasonable, but yeah. That's how you could now add a chain to each vocal individually and then the post chain for the two vocals together and all in the same track. You don't even need to group stuff. That's pretty cool. I would wish for Bitwig to actually enable more non-destructive workflows, for example, with error support or with track freeze. But um, this is a good workaround for now. So I wanted to share it with you all. 